What if I told you that the ability to regrow your baby teeth never actually left your body? It's just been sleeping. Welcome back to Medical Miracle. I'm your host, and today we read diving into one of the most fascinating questions in dental science. Can adults actually regrow their baby teeth? The answer might shock you, because the science suggests we've had this ability all along. We just needed to figure out how to wake it up. Stick around until the end. Because ILL reveal what Japanese researchers discovered that's changing everything we thought we knew about adult teeth. But first, let's hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you never miss our latest medical breakthroughs. Here's something incredible. As a child, you naturally grew two complete sets of teeth. Your baby teeth. And then your permanent teeth. But here's the question nobody asks. If your body knew how to grow teeth twice, why did it stop? Think about it. Sharks can regrow thousands of teeth throughout their lifetime. Alligators can regrow up to 3,000 teeth. Even some rodents continuously grow new teeth. So what happened to humans? The truth is, and this is crucial, we never actually lost the ability to regrow teeth. The genes are still there. They're just turned OFF. Your DNA contains all the instructions needed to grow new teeth. The same genetic blueprint that made your baby teeth and your adult teeth is still sitting inside every cell of your body right now. Scientists call these dormant genes. They're like apps on your phone that are installed but never open. The real breakthrough? Researchers in Japan have figured out how to open that app. Let me introduce you to USAG1. This is the protein that's been keeping you from regrowing teeth your entire adult life. Here's how it works. USAG1 acts like a biological lock. It suppresses a gene called BMP, which stands for bone morphogenetic protein. BMP is essential for tooth development. When you were a baby, your body needed to control tooth growth so you didn't end up with teeth growing everywhere. USAG1 was the control mechanism. But here's the problem. That lock stayed engaged even after your adult teeth came in. Dr. Katsu. Takahashi and his team at Kyoto University asked a simple question. What if we could unlock it? They developed an antibody drug that blocks USAG1. Think of it like using a key to unlock a door that's been closed for decades. In animal trials, something extraordinary happened. Mice and ferrets that received this treatment grew completely new functional teeth. Not just one or two entire sets of teeth. And here's the kicker. These weren't random teeth. They were anatomically correct teeth that grew in the right places. Right now, as I'm recording this, human trials are underway in Japan. The drug, called TRG035, is being tested on adults who are missing teeth due to congenital conditions. Early reports from Phase 1 trials showed no serious side effects. Phase 2 is focused on efficacy. Can it actually make human teeth grow back? If successful, this could be available to the public by 2030. Now, here's where it gets interesting. The question isn't really, can you regrow baby teeth? The real question is, can you activate the third set of teeth that nature intended? Some evolutionary biologists believe humans originally had the genetic capacity for a third set of teeth, just like our ancient ancestors who lived much longer without modern dental care. The USAG1 blocking method doesn't regrow your baby teeth exactly. Instead, it activates your body's dormant tooth growing machinery to produce new teeth. These teeth would be adult size, fully functional, rooted in your jawbone, made of real enamel and dentin. Think of it as pressing the restart button on tooth development, but with adult parameters. This isn't a dental implant. It's not a crown. It's not a bridge. This is your own biological tooth, grown from your own cells, using your own genetic code. The tooth would have its own blood supply, its own nerves, and its own natural connection to your jaw. Just like the teeth you were born to have. So can you regrow baby teeth as an adult? Not exactly, but you might be able to grow something even better. Within the next 5 to 10 years, we could see tooth regeneration injections at your dentist's office. No more dental implants or dentures. The end of permanent tooth loss, a complete revolution in how we think about dental care. Now, let's be realistic. 
This technology is still in development. We don't yet know how long the process takes, whether it works for all types of tooth loss, the full cost of treatment, any long-term side effects, but the science is sound. The animal trials worked, and human trials are progressing. Here's the bigger picture. If we can unlock dormant genes to regrow teeth, what else can we regrow? This same technology could potentially be applied to bone regeneration, cartilage repair, hair follicle regeneration, even organ tissue. We're not just talking about regrowing teeth. We're talking about rewriting the rules of human regeneration. So, can you regrow baby teeth as an adult? The answer is, you never really grew baby teeth in the first place. You grew your first set of adult teeth as a child, and then your second set. Now, science is unlocking your third set. The genes were always there. The ability was always there. We just needed to figure out how to turn it back on. And thanks to researchers in Japan, that day is coming sooner than you think. If you found this video fascinating, smash that like button and subscribe to Medical Miracle for more groundbreaking health and medical content. Drop a comment below. Would you try tooth regeneration therapy if it became available? Or would you stick with dental implants? And if you want to see more on the Japanese tooth regrowth trials, check out our video on TRG035 Human Trial Updates, linked in the description. Until next time, stay healthy, stay curious, and remember your body is more powerful than you ever imagined.